55% of communication is done using your body. Your body language can change the meanings of the words you say and the signals you send. So I'm here to share with you my top tips for a successful interview using your body language. You only get one chance to make a first impression. Upon meeting your interviewer, you will more than likely be greeted with a handshake. Try to match the handshake given to you with regards to pressure. Too tight and you may come across as a bit pushy and too light you may be seen as underconfident. So this is a tricky one. Making eye contact can sometimes feel really intense or awkward, but it's really important to do to show that you're interested and you're confident. But the main thing to do is to not stare out your interviewer. A really good tip that I find super helpful is to look at their eyes for a few seconds and then you could potentially look at their cheek or look at another part of their face but just don't overthink it because that's when it becomes awkward. What you're trying to do is just to keep them engaged. When you sit like this, you look small and unconfident and it affects the way you speak. Whereas when you relax your position, you sit up, you hold yourself better, then you look more engaged, you look more involved in the conversation. It also helps sit forward a little bit just to make sure you're taking in all the information. Emily. Yeah, sorry. We all do it. When you're waiting for something, you'll casually check your phone just to pass the time. But as soon as you walk into that building, you are in your interview. You need to look engaged, you need to look ready, like you want the job. And I don't know about you, but when I start kind of scrolling on my phone, my mind is elsewhere. And if I'm kind of taken out of that, I'm not thinking about what I was on before. So I won't feel as prepared. You just need to make sure that as soon as you walk into that building, you are engaged and you are ready for your interview. Hopefully with these tips, you'll feel a lot more confident going into your next job interview. All you really need to do is be yourself and know that you're the right person for the job. You've got this.